But let me first talk about money space. Who wants to, who wants to know about money space? <laughs> okay, so uh, money space came to me like a whoosh a few years ago when I was having this dialogue with myself. <laughs> um, uh, actually, like self, <laughs> um, where I, I was like, why is it that some months money comes in a lot and some months it comes in a little because I'm an entrepreneur, right? And I work for myself and, you know, depending on how much work I do, you know, certain amount of volume can come in. Um, and, and I was going through this period where I was like, but I'm working the same amount as I was before. How come it's less? And then I had this clairvoyant vision of, my money space was too small. I was like, money space? Money space? Talk to me about that. <laughs> you know? And then, and then I had this like vision of this money space like around me, like within my aura. It wasn't big enough. I didn't have a big enough money space. And then I realized, oh, I can expand out my money space just like my other spaces? How cool is that, right? And so as I expanded out my money space, then it was easier to receive more money. Now, it's not just about expanding out our money space and being grounded. That's a good part. But if we've got those subconscious walls on the outside, you know, scarcity, I don't have enough money, I um, am not good enough, or however way you don't value yourself, your gifts, or your profession, guess what? Doesn't go in, at least not all the way. So we will be doing healing for our money space this weekend.